The Boilermakers take on the Buckeyes. Massive spread on this game. I'm going to tell you one play that I think is worth your attention in this one. Welcome, everyone. I'm Andy from wagertalk.com. We're going to break down the Purdue Boilermakers and the Ohio State Buckeyes. Go ahead and hit the like button. Give me a best bet in the comment section. Give me a, a hot take on this game. If you don't have one, code word for this video is going to be warm. If you just want to help out, type the word warm. W-A-R-M in the comment section. Boost the algorithm. Helps us rank a little bit higher. Just a little token of appreciation for doing these videos. All right. I'm going to tell you why I like the Purdue Boilermakers under seven and a half on their team total. It was minus 155 at the time of recording this. I would guess it's going to keep moving. So if you're juice tolerant, go ahead and play it. If you need a parlay piece, I think that's uh, that's worthy of a, of a parlay piece. I, this is pretty basic. I mean, Ohio State is top two in yards per game allowed, and they've only allowed nine offensive touchdowns all season. So we look at this Ohio State team. I mean, at Penn State last week, they allowed 13 points uh, in a win. I mean, really, the only team that really had success was Oregon, one of the best teams in the country, if not the best, uh, where they, they scored 32 points. But Iowa only scored seven points against them. Michigan State only scored seven points against them. Western Michigan, zero. Akron, six. And then you look at Purdue, and this just has the makings of a team that looks like they're just got it done with the season. Um, this is by far the best defense they've faced all season. Um, looks like Notre Dame is probably the next highest ranked defense, and they only scored seven points against them in that game. They scored six on the road against Wisconsin, and they got shut out by Oregon and this Ohio state defense is just better. Maybe they get a late score. Maybe they get like a field goal or a touchdown late, but getting a touchdown and a field goal seems like uh, an awfully big ask. Ohio state is going to uh, control this ball. Uh, I, I don't, I don't think they're going to run up the score, which is actually probably going to help this team total go under. Cause I could just see Ohio state running the ball, running the play clock down late and uh, just, you know, getting out of the game healthy with a win. So, it's a little bit juicy, but I would take Purdue under seven and a half points. I don't see how they score there. So that is going to be uh, the play for uh, for that one. Uh, what do we have up at Wager Talk for everyone's enjoyment? Well, if you're watching this after Thursday, um, we've got uh, college football best bet that is up. And we also have a UFC best bet that is up. Those plays are 4%. You can grab those over at wagertalk.com, WT slash buzz. And as always, uh, we always kind of try and be open and transparent with our record. I haven't done that the last couple of videos. So, uh, so far up to date, 496 wins, 318 losses for plus 162.14 units. We're, we're trying to get to 175 units by the end of the year. Our original goal was 100 units. That would have been that would have been a great year for us. And we've blown through expectations uh, at 162 units. So uh, coming off of a really bummer of a loss in college football, we got tripped up full disclosure by the by the Army uh, quarterback situation. Had their team total over 31 and a half all week long. Bang, the quarterback gets ruled out. But. Or seven and three, even including that one, seven and three on the year in college football, twenty and seven lifetime, even with that. So uh, we're 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 perfectly fine with the with the, the handicap and our winning percentage there. And UFC uh, hitting sixty five percent in the last few months. So uh, we're having a really solid year. Proud of the work that we're doing. Uh, gets a little wonky this time of year, but that's right up our alley. We got some really nice plays um, that are up there. Uh, 4% UFC play and the 4% college football play. So Saturday is looking really, really nice. So if you want all of our plays, just grab a three-day package. Those are up at uh, Wager Talk. Just go over to the to the right side of the screen. You can grab a three-day pass, get you all percentages, all plays, including NFL, six straight winning weeks in a row in NFL. So real happy with all that. All right, guys, that's going to do it for us. Um, Let's root on the Ohio State defense to shut out the Purdue Boilermakers and let's cash those 4% plays. As always, if you got any questions about anything, just leave a comment. I always read the comments, uh, uh, and I'm here to help. So any questions or anything, just leave them in the comment section. Good luck on your place, and we'll see everyone later.